Hello class! Welcome back to our channel. So for today's video, our topic is all about the domain and range of exponential function. Pero bago tayo mag-proceed sa ating topic, uh, define muna natin ano bang ibig sabihin ng domain and range. So domain guys is the set of all possible x values while range is the possible or the set of all possible y values of a given function. Okay? So, this time, magpo-focus muna tayo, guys, kay exponential functions. Okay? So, first, uh, let f of x is equal to a times b raised to p of x plus h be an exponential function where p of x is linear. Okay? So, dito, guys, yung ating p of x, yan yung exponent ng ating base. Pag sinabi nating linear, guys, ibig sabihin, yung degree ng ating exponent ay 1. Okay? So, sabi dito, then, the domain of the function is the set of all real numbers. Ibig sabihin, uh, yung x natin is any real numbers. Okay? Or in interval notation naman, that is negative infinity to positive infinity yung ating possible x values. Okay? Then, sa range naman, sabi dito, if a is greater than 0, or if a is positive, siya yung nandito guys, yung unang number dito sa ating exponential function. If a is positive, ibig sabihin, yung range natin is from h to positive infinity. Okay, yung h naman, yan yung constant natin dito sa ating exponential function. Okay? Then, if a is negative, yung range natin is from negative infinity to h. Okay? So, let's have our first example. Find the domain and range of the following exponential function. So, number 1, meron tayong f of x is equals to... Uh, 3 raised to x. So, again, sabi natin kanina, uh, yung exponential function natin, ang domain niya is always um, from negative infinity to positive infinity. Tama? Since yung ating exponent ay linear, so, wala tayong restriction dyan. Okay? Or in interval or in set notation naman, that is the set of all x such that x is any real numbers. Nakuha? Next is for the range naman. So dito, uh, ang una yung i-check guys is yung ating a. Okay, so yung a natin is yung sign dito. So since positive yung ating a or positive 1, ibig sabihin... Ang susundin nating range is yung from h to positive infinity. Tama? So, dito guys, ah, nawawala yung h natin. Ibig sabihin, ang value ng h natin ay 0. Tama? So, that is, kung 0 yung h natin, ang range natin is from 0 to positive infinity. Okay? So, in set notation naman, that is the set of all y such that y is greater than 0. Nakuha guys? So, let's have example number 2. g of x is equals to 4 raised to x plus 1 minus 2. So, dito, uh, yung exponent natin is linear. Ibig sabihin, kung i-identify natin si domain, ang domain natin dito guys is from negative infinity to Positive infinity. Tama? So, wala na naman tayong restriction. So, in set notation, that is the set of all x such that x is any real numbers. Okay? Next is for the range naman. Ang range natin dito, guys, is first observe natin si a. So, dito, ang a natin is positive ulit. Diba? Kasi meron tayong 4 raised to x plus 1. Ibig sabihin, ang a natin is positive 1 or positive. So, ang gagamitin natin formula for range is yung h comma positive infinity. Okay? 
So, in, in our example, si negative 2 ito yung ating h. So, therefore, ang range natin is from negative 2 to positive infinity. Okay? So, in set notation, that is the set of all y such that y is greater than negative 2. Nakuha, guys? So, let's have example number 3. So, dito, uh, we have h of x equals negative 2 raised to x minus 1 plus 3. So, again, ang ating exponent ay x minus 1 and that's linear. So, that means yung domain natin is from negative infinity to positive infinity pa rin. Okay, so in set notation, that is the set of all x such that x is any real numbers. Okay, then sa range naman, first, check natin yung ating a. So, in this case, meron tayong negative doon sa ating exponential expression. Ibig sabihin, ang follow nating pattern is yung from negative infinity to h. Okay, so ang range natin dito, uh, we have negative infinity to h. So, so, ang h natin is yung positive 3. Tama? So, we have negative infinity comma 3. Okay? So, in, in set notation, that is the set of all y such that y is less than positive 3. Okay, naka less than tayo ngayon. Ibig sabihin, from 3 to negative infinity yung value ng ating range. Okay? So, last, number 4. We have f of x is equal to 2 times 3 raised to 2x minus 3 plus 5. So, again, ang ating exponent ay 2x minus 3 and that is linear. So, that means, ang domain natin is from negative infinity to positive infinity. Tama? In set notation, that is the set of all x such that x is any real numbers. Okay? Then, for the range naman, first, observe natin yung a. So, in our case, meron tayong negative 2. Ibig sabihin, negative ang a natin or less than 0. Okay, so ang follow nating pattern is negative infinity, comma h. So, in this case, ang h natin is positive 5. Tama? So, ito yung ating range. Okay, so ito yung interval notation. In set notation, that is equivalent to the set of all y, such that y is less than positive 5. Nakuha, guys? So, ganyan yung method kung paayon natin kinukuha yung domain and range ng ating exponential function. So, this is the end of our video. I hope uh, naintindihan nyo guys yung ating lesson. So, if you have questions or clarifications, kindly put them in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. This is Prof. D. I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye!